At Politics and Prose Bookstore in Washington, D.C., Yale environmental law professor Daniel Esty offered suggestions on ways to create environmental change and sustainability. Here's a portion of the program. My own analysis of the 20th century is that one of the biggest shortcomings is that we did not ask where the money would come from to do the things we knew we needed to do. We assumed that if a rule was established, the money would follow. And it turns out, um, and we have set targets and timetables in our climate change treaty of 1992, and again, we assumed people would follow. And guess what? They didn't. Now, I call this the lawyer's mistake, because usually only lawyers are the ones, and I apologize, because I know several of you are lawyers, uh, as I look out across the audience. Um, but it turns out, lawyers think if you adopt a rule, pass a law, sign a treaty, that behavior will change. And reality is, it doesn't, or at least in many cases it doesn't. And no one in business would be surprised. They would say, well, your climate change treaty was like writing a mission statement for a company. Where's the, the business change model? Where's the, the implementation plan? And we underattended to that, including critically where the money would come from. So I think we now see a new push uh, for green bonds and green banks and a whole set of mechanisms to flow capital to the kind of projects that need to be done, the kind of companies that are helping deliver a sustainable future. And I do think that is, in fact, um, very promising. To watch the rest of this program, visit our website, booktv.org, and search for Daniel Esty or the title of his book, A Better Planet, using the box at the top of the page.